guys welcome back to my channel it's me tally girl aka anaya we are back again today with another video today's video is about my relaxed hair care empties i have quite a few to show you guys um so let's go ahead and not waste any time and hop into the video okay so i have been using a products um i've really been trying to not be a product junkie since i've started this new hair care journey i'm not i'm trying to show restraint and not buy like everything i see and every new product and everything that everybody says is good um but i'm happy because i have been using up products so that's really good let's go ahead and hop in i'm just gonna pull stuff out of here and yeah so First, I have the Curls, Waves, and Natural Hair uh, Lusters S Curl No Drip Curl Activator Moisturizer. That is a mouthful. But this product right here, this is completely empty. I brought this off a recommendation of some other relaxed hair girls. Um, sorry, y'all. My foot was going to sleep. Um, I bought this off a of recommendation, and I really like this. I would definitely repurchase this product. It kept my hair soft and moisturized, and it's lightweight. I'm finding that some of the products that I had left over when I was natural are just too heavy for my relaxed hair, and I don't really like them as much as I liked them when I was natural. So this is really bomb. Definitely would repurchase this. Um, not right now because I just have so many products on my like wish list that I want to try um, but this is definitely something like if I just want to go back to something that I know will work definitely would repurchase this so next up we have some extra virgin olive oil I use this whole bottle um, I already have another one I love extra virgin olive oil my hair loves it it's phenomenal definitely this is like a staple for me uh, next, I have this Cream of Nature Coconut Milk Detangling and Conditioning Leave-In Conditioner. So, I actually used all this product, but I put water and um, conditioner in here um, to make like a detangler because I had ran out of this one, obviously. <laughs> and um, so that's what's in here, but I did use up all of this actual product. Um, I don't think I would repurchase this. It just wasn't that good and I have a new detangler that I'm trying out now that I actually really really like and it helps me get through my hair even when I'm like stretching my relaxer and I'm towards the end of my stretch and I'm like three and four months that really helps me a little bit more than this one does so I probably wouldn't repurchase this um it was just okay to be honest um next up i have this shea moisture daily hydration shampoo and conditioner Whew, this is bomb okay i love this love this love this this is like a little mini set these are eight fluid ounces but i use the crap out of these like there's literally almost nothing left i love this the shampoo is so moisturizing but it cleanses your hair and the conditioner will have your hair fill in buttery smooth love these would definitely repurchase I actually just bought a new shampoo conditioner from Shea Moisture that I'm trying out I've only used it once but this will definitely definitely be beyond um will be on my list to repurchase okay next up I have one of my holy grail deep conditioners this is the Shea Moisture Manuka Honey Imafura Oil Intensive Hydration Hair Mask. Um, I love this. I've gone through several jars of this. Um, and this one's completely empty. I was not playing. I got all of the product out of this. Um, love this deep conditioner. I already have a new one that is being used. Um, love this this is another staple this has to stay in my collection at all times because it's just that good um so next this is not an empty but i put this in my empty hair bin because this was one of the few products that has stopped working on my hair since i've been relaxed and this is the eco olive oil gel um 
this one is just really drying on my relaxed hair I found and it's really like crispity crunchy on my hair and I just don't like it um, so this is what's left over in this I'm gonna give this to my sisters because they love eco styler gel um, and they're natural so they'll probably really like this one but yeah the olive oil one mm -mm. so I will give this to my sisters so because that gel didn't work I decided to try the argan oil one and I actually had a mini of the eco styler argan oil and I used it up completely and I actually bought a big jar because this one works a whole lot better it gives me whole and it's not super drying so I really like this one definitely would repurchase already repurchased it and next I have this I'm sorry y'all everything has hair on it oh my god like I didn't even realize this like okay so this is a oil um I took the label off because I was using this applicator bottle for something else but this is was the Tropic Isle Black Castor Growth Oil um I actually bought another bottle of this I'm almost done but I won't be repurchasing it because I have been mixing up my own oil and I really really like it and it has really helped my hair so I'm going to be using that instead of repurchasing this oil, but I did like it. I just have moved on to better things. So this is the Tropic Isle uh, Hair Growth Oil. And last but not least, this is the ORS Olive Oil Incredibly Rich Oil Moisturizing Hair Lotion. So I'm actually not done with this product. It's um about down here <sighs> but I know a lot of y'all like this but I do not like this product at all um I uh no so this product I have found does not like absorb into my hair and it doesn't give me that moisture it kind of just sits on top for me and it makes my hair kind of waxy and greasy but yet my hair still feels dry it's like um I can't explain it it's like having like really dry brittle hair and then just putting like hair grease on it like it's that feeling like it's greasy and weighed down but it's not moisturized and I don't like this um, I know a lot of people do like it a lot of relaxed girls like it but I just mm -mm. No, I tried to like it. I thought I liked it at first, but then I was realizing that it just really wasn't moisturizing my hair because using other products like the S Curl, um, I found out what my hair actually feels like when it's properly moisturized and this was not doing it. It was just sitting on top of my hair and I couldn't even use it all up. I was trying to, but I was just like, this is just not doing it and it just made my hair feel terrible so I would not recommend this definitely would not buy it it's a no-go um next I have two straight hair products in here that they're really full um but I'm not gonna be using them um so I'll probably give them to my sisters this is the OG Fantasia IC heat protector spray um I kept this around because it smells really good but I'm gonna get rid of it. And then this is the Mazzani Therma Smooth uh, Shine Extend um, Spritz. Um, I bought this because somebody did my hair at a salon and they used this. And I, I don't really be using it like that. <laughs> um, I have other straight hair products that I really, really like on my, um, when I blow dry my hair. I've been, I've never flat ironed my hair. The only time I get a flat iron is when I get a fresh relaxer. But when I blow dry my hair, I like to use the Chi Silk Infusion and the Chi Iron Guard. So I don't really use these products. So I just do these in here. But yeah, those are all of my empties. Um, this little then is empty now so yeah thank you guys for watching this video um let me know what you think of these products below are these products that you like that you have purchased are these any staples in your collection let's chat down below and i'll see you guys in my next video bye